Hey friend, what's going on? My name is Janae Nicole Kay and welcome into your stronger class. Today I've got a full body power vinyasa yoga sculpt planned for you today. So you are going to need a set of weights. I'm going to be using five pound weights and you're going to want to place them at the top of your mat so that they're easy to access when we need them. All of the movement and exercises from this class comes directly from my stronger program, which you can find more about linked in the description below. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get seated. Just come into a comfortable seated position, sitting bones firmly pressed into the mat. We're sitting up nice and tall, reaching through the crown of our head. Just gently close the eyes here and let's take a moment to arrive at the present moment. Starting to inhale and exhale through the nose. Noticing how as we inhale, the belly inflates. And as we exhale, the belly deflates and we squeeze all of that air out. We start to really connect the mind and the breath together to remind us that we're no longer where we were before this. We're not where we're going to be after this. We're simply just here on our mats, giving back to ourselves in the name of self-care. Start to get deeper in the breaths, deeply inhaling, filling the belly up all the way through the nose. Open mouth, exhale, let everything go. See if you can relax the shoulders away from the ears just a little bit. Inhale again, fill the belly up all the way. Open mouth, exhale. Last time like this, inhale, fill the belly up all the way. Open mouth, exhale. Go ahead and gently blink the eyes open. And let's come on to all fours for some cat cow and wrist warm ups. So, shoulders stuck directly above the wrist, hips stuck directly above the knees. From here, we take an inhale, we drop the belly, lift the gaze to the sky. And on the exhale, we're gonna arch the back, press the mat away. Inhale again, drop the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, arch the back, press the mat away. Pick up the tempo a little bit here. Inhale, drop the belly. Exhale, arch the back. Inhale, drop the belly. Exhale, arch the back. Keep moving like this. For four, for three, for two, and one. Come to a neutral tabletop position here. And let's just sway the hips from side to side. You know, further warming up the hips and the wrist. Start to roll your body around the world. One way, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And the other way, two, three, four. One, two, Three, back again the other way. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And back. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. From here, we're gonna tuck the toes under, come into a high plank position. Then we send the hips up and back. Down dog. Gripping the mat nice and tight with the fingertips, hips are high, shoulders drawn away from the ears. We inhale here, come high up on the toes. Exhale, melt the heels down to the left. Inhale, come high up on the toes. Exhale, melt the heels down through center. In center, go ahead here and just pedal out your dog, alternating the heels up and down. Inhale again, high up on the toes. Exhale, melt the heels down to the right this time. 
Inhale, come high up on the toes. Exhale, bend the knees, look forward, step to the top of your mats. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold, look into the belly button, bend into that right knee. Left hand plants down to the mat, right arm comes up for a twist. Breathe here. Dropping the hand down to the mat, straighten out the rest of the right leg. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold, step back, high plank, and back, down dog. Inhale, come high up on the toes. Exhale, melt the heels down to the left. Inhale, high up on the toes. Exhale, the heels down to the right. Inhale, come high up on the toes. Bend the knees, look forward, step to the tops of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, this time we bend into the left knee. We plant the right hand to the mat, send the left arm up, come up for a twist. Breathe here. Really reach to the fingertips. Drop that left hand, straighten up the left leg. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, swoop the arms up. Send the tailbone back. Chair pose. Inhale here. Exhale, fold. Inhale, root to rise. Rolling up one vertebrae at a time. Bringing the arms up overhead. Palms touch at the top. Exhale, the hands to heart center. Inhale, bring the arms up overhead, touch the palms at the top. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Step back. High plank. Now we're going to stay in high plank here. So let's get comfy. We're just going to start to rock back and forth on the toes here. Back and forth. Back and forth. Really press those palms and fingertips into the mat. Keep that belly button drawn into the spine. You've got it here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. We're gonna dip the knees here and dip, dip. So you're just pedaling up the knees. Yes, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Right knee crosses to the left elbow and back. Elbow and back. Elbow, back, elbow, back. And four, three, Two, one, shoulder taps, tap, 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 for eight, seven, six, five, four, we're gonna go back to those kickbacks, this time the left knee comes to the right elbow, in three, two, one, left, elbow, right, knee, kick back, knee, kick back, knee, kick back, knee, kick back. Here for four, three, two, and one. High plank, lower yourselves all the way down to the chest. Lift the tops of the feet onto the mat, forehead comes to the mat. Inhale up for cobra. Press the tops of the feet into the mat. Exhale, forehead to mat. Inhale again, up for cobra. Exhale, forehead to mat. Go ahead, bring the arms out wide. Tense the fingertips, elbows come up. Inhale, 
Open her up for Cobra. Cobra variation here, just opening up the shoulders. Exhale, forehead to mat. Roll up for Cobra. Exhale, forehead to mat. Walk the hands back toward the chest. Tuck the toes under. Come up. High plank. Exhale, the hips up and back. Down dog. Inhale, come high up on the toes. Bend the knees. Look forward. Step to the top of your mat. Grab your weight. Inhale, halfway up. Add a row. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair pose. Break the weight to the shoulders and up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift again. Add a row. Exhale, fold. Drop the weight. Step back. Down dog. Inhale, right leg kicks up. Exhale, right knee to nose. Inhale, right leg kicks up. Exhale, right knee to nose. Inhale, right leg kicks up. Exhale, send the right foot all the way through. Grab your weights, shoulders and up. Exhale, warrior two, slight bend in the elbows. Inhale, reverse your warrior, punch that right weight up. Exhale, drop the weight, pivot. Weights come down to the floor, step back, chaturanga. Up dog, down dog. Catch your breath here, deep inhale, fill the belly up all the way. Mouth exhale. Good. Left side, inhale, left leg comes up. Exhale, left knee to nose. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left knee to nose. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left foot comes all the way through. Grab the weights, shoulders and up. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse your warrior. Left weight comes up. Exhale, bring the weights down to the shoulders. Pivot to the front. Drop your weights. Step back. Chaturanga. Up dog. And down dog. Ooh, yeah. Inhale, right leg up. Exhale, send that right foot all the way through. Inhale, up for high lunge. Exhale, open up. Warrior two. Let's grab the weights from the top of the mat. I'm going to take both weights and place them in the right hand. Come into a wide-legged squat here. Sit low. Right arm comes behind the body. We're just going to do some oblique dips here. You push the weight down and pull. Down and pull. Down, pull, down. Pull, we're here for eight, seven, you've got it, six, five, keep your core engaged, four, did you feel it on that left oblique, and three, two, one, right arm, right elbow comes into the right hip, sit low in that squat, we're going to press the weight up and over, bring it back down to the hip, up and over, to the hip, up and over, to the hip, up and over, to the hip. You've got it, push, push. Remember to breathe, push for eight, seven, what do we got next? Six, five, four, Three, keep going for two. Last one. Take a break. All right. Weights come out to the sides. Micro bend in the arms here. Sit low in that squat again. As we come into a squat, we're gonna bend and curl. Come up to standing. Keep that slight bend in the elbow. Bend and curl, up to stand. Bend and curl, up to stand. Bend and curl, stand, bend and curl, 
stand. We're here for eight, seven, squeeze, six, five, four. We're gonna hold the weights out and pulse them outwards. And three, two, one, stay low. Follow me, pulse, pulse, pulse. Pulse, we're here for eight, seven, six, ooh, my shoulder's burning, five, four, three, two, and one. Left hand comes to hip, right arm comes up, reverse warrior, bring those weights down, pivot to the front, drop your weights here, step back, chaturanga, ooh yeah. Up dog, ring it out, down dog. This is burning so good. Inhale, left leg comes up. Exhale, send the left foot all the way through. Grab your weights, shoulders and up. Inhale, exhale, warrior two, micro bend in the arms. I'm gonna face you this time. This time, the weight's coming to the left hand. Sit low in that squat. Whew. Left arm comes behind the back. We're gonna dip and come up. Dip, up, dip, up, dip, up. Make sure we're squeezing into the glutes. We're keeping that core engaged. Remember, this is a full body yoga sculpt. For eight, seven, you've got this. Six, where were you the last time? See if you can push yourself for just a couple more seconds longer. Four, three, we're gonna transition here in two and one. Left elbow comes to the left hip. Press it over and back, over and back, over and back, over and back. We're here for eight, push, seven, six. I know you can do this for five, four, three, two, and one, bring the weight to the hip, grab one weight, one hand, come to a standing position, and you're gonna box out the arms here, kind of like a cactus. As we squeeze the elbows together, we're gonna come down to a squat, come back up, squeeze. We're squatting and closing, we're coming up and we're squeezing. We're down and up, down and up, you've got it, down, and up, down, and up. We're here for eight, seven, stay with it, six, five, four. We're gonna hold the squat and change up the arms a little bit. And three, two, one. Weights come down to the hips, holding our squat. We push the weight out. We bring it back in, push out, squat, come back in, push and in, push and in, push and in. We're here for eight, seven. Keep those elbows nice and tight by the sides. And six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold and pulse, pulse. Pulse, pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Right hand comes to the hip, pivot, left arm comes up, reverse warrior. Drop the weight down to the shoulders, pivot over the left shoulder, drop your weight, step back, chaturanga. Dog and down dog. Amazing work, everybody. 
shift forward, come to high plank. Drop the knees down onto the mat. Let's come onto our back sides. Cannon class without firing up the core. The center of all of our power, all of our creativity, our confidence. That's why I end every single class with targeted ab work. So, what we're doing here, we're gonna bring ourselves all the way down to the mat. Legs come up the wall, hands come behind the back, shoulders off the mat. Left leg low, right leg lowers, kick it up. Just the right leg, up. Engage the core, we're pressing the lower abdomen into the mat, or the lower back into the mat, which fires up the lower abdomen. For eight, seven, six, you've got this, five, four, three, two, and one. Leg comes up, place the hands underneath the butt. We reverse crunch, come back, kick the legs out to the center. Reverse crunch, kick it out. Reverse crunch and out. Crunch and out. Crunch and out. Fire it up for eight, seven, six. You've got this, sis. Five, four, three, two, and one. Bicycle with the legs, right knee to chest, left leg hovers. We come up for a sit up, we switch the legs, we come back. Up for a sit up, switch the legs, and back. For four, switch the legs, down. For three, switch the legs. For two, switch the legs. And one. Leg switch. Come down. Give yourself a nice good stretch. Arms reach up over the head. Arch the back like you just woke up this morning. We've got one more round of abs. Let's go ahead and get after that. This time, we're gonna lower the left leg. So legs come up the wall, left leg lowers, kick it back up, lower and kick. Lower and kick. Lower and kick. Lower and kick. We're here for eight, seven, can you find it? Six, I know you've got it in you. We push ourselves to the edge. We do the hard things until they're not hard. We transition here. And three, two, one. Hands come underneath the butt. Reverse crunch, legs come out. Crunch, come out. Crunch, come out. This is where we would distinguish between what's hard and what's challenging. I used to have a coach that would say, the ground is hard, this is challenging. And guess what? You can overcome any challenge. Stay here for four, for three, for two, and one. Bicycle with the legs, bring it up, switch the legs. Down, just the legs, down, that one's a toughie, up, for four, for three, for two, you've got this, Ooh. for one, lower down, overcame that challenge, I know whoever is watching this video, definitely did <laughs> let's come back onto all fours just to cool down a little bit where are we with time cool 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 we're gonna just do some cat cow inhale drop the belly lift the gaze 
Exhale, arch the back, press the mat away. <sighs> Inhale, drop the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, arch the back, press the mat away. Come to neutral tabletop position, just shift the hips side to side. Bring that right leg to the outer edge of the right hand for lizard pose. Right leg comes back, tabletop position. Left leg comes forward. Lizard on the left hand side. Oh yeah. My psoas or my inner thighs are on fire. Which is good because we're usually stretching our psoas in yoga and we hardly strengthen it. And I feel like that's one of those things that I just, I need to work on. Send that left foot back. Knees come to the outer edges of the mat. Bring the heels to touch. Inhale here. Exhale, sit the booties back onto the heels. Come into a child's pose. You have the option to stay here in child's pose. If you'd like, you may take a Shavasana. I'm gonna go ahead and shift the weight forward. Come on to the standing. Still in teaching mode, I don't know why I needed to narrate that. But anyways, thank you so much for joining me for this class today. If you like this flow, please let me know what you liked about it in the comments. Maybe make a suggestion as to what I should target in my next power vinyasa. Um, let's see, I have some notes here. Oh yeah. Learn more about my Stronger program, links in the description below. Like this video, share it with a friend, subscribe to my channel, turn on those post notifications. I think I've got everything down, so without further ado, I'm out of here. <laughs> I'll see you in the next video, friend. Bye-bye.